All right, here's a quick view. The front of my car is now very low. Um, I still have the inch and a half drop springs on the front end, um, but I do have the race stars on. So hopefully I don't drag a freaking anything coming out of the garage or on the road towards the track. Go ahead and give side view here. Just got them on and torqued in. Uh, these are the front skinnies. They are 185, 55, 17s. The rims are race stars. They are 17 inches. That way they clear the front brakes. It has a very, very aggressive stance. I can't wait to actually get it out on the road and uh, see what the stance looks like. Um, I'm kind of in my wash bay, so the concrete kind of slopes towards the center here. Here's the rear race stars. I've had them for a while, as you guys know. Um, one thing to know here is that I did have to go back to my factory springs on the back because one and a half inch drop um, caused the tires to rub on the inner fender well. And, uh, you know, I don't really want to bust my fender or bust the tire, so um, I had to put the stock springs back in. And not the inner fender well, but the lip right here is where it was rubbing, so. All right, hey, thanks for watching. That's the Race Star rims. Um, if you've already dropped your car, you'll need to think about putting your uh, factory springs back in the rear. Front looks really mean, setting really nose to the ground. Uh, nice drag stance, and uh, we'll see what we can put together this weekend at the Expo. Thanks for watching. Bye.